see how they get the start off now. You see uh, number 25, Smith Davies, he's going to be on the left wing here to start the game. Coach like both him and Hughes, brand new to the team. 10 26, and five good enough for 25 points, which uh, might not do it. Oh, there's a big hit there. He's not going to want to give up many chances like that. As you see, here's a nice, nice hit by Pugera. Pugera's a very solid kid. He's very strong, good on his feet. Set it up at the point to go far side. Go cross ice, and there's a shot. The score! Power play goal. Ray Rampton, assisted by Gabe Giblin. So power play strikes right off the bat. Grand Prairie didn't really get their box formed. One, nothing, old. See how Grand Prairie can react to that. Back. Takes a look up the ice. Oh, he gives it away right in front. Here's a chance for Olds. They fire it far side. This is saved by Jones is right behind him. He's looking one way, but they clear it now. Here's a shot from the point, and they score. The storm got running around. They couldn't keep their eye on the puck. And it's two nothing in this new game. Wow. Goal by McEntee. Yeah, they just kept running around and he fires it in and there's a whole bunch of people in front of Jones. He couldn't find the puck through all those people. So the puck was behind him there, but the Grand Prix player managed to clear it out and went right to the point. Push down, puts the puck over. Strelis jumps up and gives it to Copetti. Copetti has a chance now, goes in, backhand. Oh, good save by Como. He's getting forced out by Ryder, many gray horses. So new storm cash dance comes out. An effort for Bay now behind the net. Bounce over his stick to Smith Davies. He has it, takes a look around. Comes back and takes a shot, really quick shot. Looking for the rebound. Abbott, he uh, he doesn't like all the Grand Prairie Storm players buzzing around. He pushes Doherty back. Nothing comes of that. The rest say, settle down, boys, settle down. There's more than one restaurant in town you can eat at. Doherty gets some help with Thorne. Hankel has it now, and he gets dumped to the ice by Cunningham. Thorne picks it up now for the... Help for the captain, he's for Strillitz. Strillitz takes a shot, deflected by Smith Davies, gets a chance there. Nice well, pad save by Como. Corbet, the captain, drops a stick behind the net. Smith Davies comes in with a great four check. There's a chance there. Oh, Storm, get it, but it goes back high and wide. For a second, wondering what happened, he goes back at him again. Here's a shot now, a chance in the front. They got looking for the rebound. They can't go again. There's out in front. These Corbet had a wide open net. Pate is back there. He's throwing gloved punches at a fully cased mask of Doherty. Smith Davies is in there too. Corbet standing there with McEntee. They're having a discussion. Of course, you don't want to start another fight and get thrown out of the game. So cooler heads are going to prevail as the refs talk. Thorne picks it up. Here's a chance now for a three on one. He's got Georgie with him. Georgie twos. Back to Georgie. Georgie just missed the wide open net. What a great tic tac toe play. And he just missed the open net. But the storm, they're still with it. They're sticking away. The Harris has it now. He goes far side to his point. Strillet steps up. There's a quick snapshot. There's Georgie and or Thorne a chance. The thing that amazes me with these young players is how well they take direction and listen. Very determined. Nice hit. Man, there. Chance there for Corbet. Scores a goal. He takes a pass from Cunningham. Rips it top corner under the glove of Abe Como, I guess. Moves Grand Prairie within one. The building comes alive. Second period. 11.52.
off the faceoff. Now he's going to spin and fire it right there under the glove of Camo. He didn't really have a chance. Just going to spin off the boards. Captain gets a team back within one. Cunningham has it now, goes to Harris. Harris takes a fire shot. Blocker saved by Como. Old's Grizzly player just grabbed and kind of threw it. Storm bench calling for a penalty. Thorne Curls goes back to the point. Cunningham he looks over Harris, but he drives a shot in, looking for a redirect. Oh, the shot scores! Captain Cormay gets it over the backhand pass to Tews. Tews is Johnny on the spot. Captain Corbet's second point in the game with that assist. That comes at 9 for 25. Second period. Right there's the backhand pass. Wide open net. Tews does not miss this time. Fired in from the point. Corbet just grabs that rebound and backhands it. Wide open. They tie the game 2-2. Shots are 25 to 11 for the Grand Prix Storm. We got a hockey game, Ty. Steps up off the line, goes down in the corner. Jordy goes far side, he's looking for Atwell. Atwell just wasn't quite there at the net yet. He stops up, goes back for Strelitz. Strelitz looks at Hughes, goes to Hughes. Hughes takes a look now. He goes back into the corner there for Doherty. Doherty was going up high, but Aiden Como, he read that play and got his glove up there to catch it. Good play there, pass, pass, pass shot. So here's that chance there. You just see the end of it where Como grabs it. So that was a uh, twos. That was his eighth goal of the year. Copetti's in there for it. He goes along the boards back to Strill. Strill takes a quick little shot. Looking for a rebound. Deflected in. Goal. Alex Atwill. He scores 1908 into the third period. Well, 1908 left in the third period because this period just started. Redirecting Strillis' shot. Strillis picked it up. I think it was Hughes or Copetti that passed it to Strillis. There's that shot. Strillis and Atwell just deflects it over the glove hand of Como. That's Copetti. Copetti passes the wingers or the guys lining up on the hash marks. Oh, they're going to fight. Corbet and Turwood. Corbet is unloading a couple shots on him. He gets the rights going on him. Turwood fires back with some rights of his own. Corbet delivers one over the top, under the, over the top, under, undercut, over the top, undercut, over top. Turwood's eating a few more than he wants, so he tries to drag him down and bulldog him. But that's a strong kid there. You don't see those old school scraps like that. Captain Corbet, Corbet has a message for them. Captain standing up. And they go to their respective rooms. We're getting coincidentals probably for fighting. Look at Corbet just feeding him on the top. Turwood did, did well to trade shots with him. Corbet just got a few more in there. He's pretty strong, Corbet. He's actually really strong. Now, Doherty picks it up, goes over, fires it across dump. He's going to go get it. Comes back in. Oh, he tried to put it in high as Aiden Como was down on his knees. Chance out, and Christensen takes a shot. Here's a rebound. That's goal! by Doherty to go down there and get the puck on his own dump in. Then you see that rebound. He just buries it. Here's the first chance. Great save by Aiden Como. And then Chase gets his rebound. Fires in the top corner. 15 left of the third period is 4-2. Grand Prairie Storm. We'll see if they give Doherty an assist on that as they pounded to the ice. He gets up right away. Copetti right on front. Here's a chance for Patrick. Nice save. Jones just stared him down. He goes to Atwell. Atwell goes over to Georgie. And they are playing keep away. Two seconds left. Grand Prairie Storm win back-to-back -back games at home ice as they defeat 
Old Grizzlies four to two. It's exactly what Coach Eric wanted. Shots on goal are 37 to 21.